This piece of used gum cost $50 million. We got it today. And now, we're about to do the unthinkable. The trees have all gone quiet. This gum was once chewed by the legendary jazz artist Kira Vale, a voice that moved millions. Behind us in the hush of falling snow, your hand in mine feels steady. Like time Kira Vale was everywhere, radio, bars, TV, you name it. She made the 1950s very special. We all loved her. We loved her voice. But your eyes are full of sun. She sold millions of records. Everyone had a Kira Vale record. You couldn't escape her, and no one wanted to. The cold won't last long. She was truly one of a kind. Everything was going so perfect until tragedy struck. We interrupt this broadcast with breaking news. Legendary jazz vocalist Kira Vale has died in a tragic car accident. Authorities report that her vehicle was struck by a drunk driver late last night. She was 57 years old. Kira Vale was taken before her time. She still had so much to say and so many songs left in her. Before her death, Kira Vale signed the rights to her music, voice, and likeness to Golden Hour Sound, a New York-based label. It started by the sea where the tide rolled in. So Today, we're honored to announce that Golden Hour Sound will be cloning a legendary jazz artist using this preserved biological sample recovered decades ago. Now you know. We acquired this sample through a recent auction. It was originally recovered from the scene of Kira Vale's death, and DNA testing later confirmed it belonged to her. We've extracted a sufficient amount of DNA from the gum, and we're ready to move to the next phase of cloning. We didn't need a song of fireworks in July, just the sand beneath Now comes the final step, implanting the embryo into the surrogate, where it will begin to grow into a baby. But I knew right then it started by the sea. The surrogate is doing well. We've monitored every stage closely, vitals, hormone levels, fetal development. Everything's progressing normally. I'd bury deep than you. has officially shattered global streaming and sales records, making her the most successful recording artist alive today. And the Grammy Award for Best Vocal Performance goes to Kira Vale. That's her eighth Grammy tonight. Kira has been one of our most successful investments, creatively, commercially, and culturally. She carries the same aura the original Kira was known for. We're proud to announce a new initiative to revive more voices that shaped history. Golden Hour Sound is committed to honoring artistic legacies. Over the next 10 years, we plan to clone around 70 well-known artists across jazz, pop, soul, and more. Artists may be gone, but their DNA, their contracts, and their value remain. We're simply continuing their journey, entrusted to us in good faith. No more clones, let them rest! Humans aren't tools for your test! Protests continue across several states today, 
as pressure mounts to ban human cloning. Much of the outrage is focused on Kira Vale. To the woman calling herself Kira Vale, you wear her face, but you'll never carry her soul. Kira Vale, you're a lab-grown knockoff pretending to be someone you'll never understand. They stitched my name on every stage. Lit me up like someone new. But every note I try to sing still sounded just like you so raise a glass to the replica who danced in someone's shoes all that Kira Vale vanished two years no posts no shows last we saw she was getting roasted for being a clone is she ever coming back We've learned Kira Vale is under legal threat from her label unless she returns to the stage. Sources say she may be considering a new career path. Kira Vale said she is returning to the stage next week with a big surprise. Are you excited about it? Nobody cares about her. She's not relevant anymore. We're getting confirmation tonight. Kira Vale has officially changed her name to Cora Phillips and a new song is on the way. Will it be a hit? Too soon to tell. I heard the whispers, saw the post They call me fake, they did the most But I've been quiet, I've been still Now I'm the storm you tried to kill You want the past, then play a record But I'm not her, I've been restructured You miss the ghost, but I'm the fire from pressure, not desire. I'm back louder, colder, new name. New what the hell was she thinking? Worst comeback ever. This isn't art, it's a midlife crisis. She needs to step back and let real artists take the stage. Yeah. So Kira Vale just dropped a new song. Oh, wait, it's Cora Phillips now. <laughs> Sweetheart, you can change the name all you want. You're still a clone. No grip. Phillips is now facing a $500 million lawsuit from her label after rebranding without their approval and releasing her controversial new single. On March 17, 1962, Kira Vale signed a binding contract with our client Golden Hour Sound. Legally speaking, her clone Cora Phillips is still liable due to 100% genetic similarity between the two. This lawsuit is baseless. A clone is not a legal continuation of the original. Holding Cora liable for someone else's contract sets a dangerous precedent. She didn't even exist when the contract was signed. After reviewing the evidence and arguments presented, this court finds in favor of the plaintiff. Ms. Phillips is hereby ordered to pay damages totaling $300 million for breach of contract, damages to brand reputation, and harm to the label. Cora Phillips suffered a major blow in court today. With her career fading, experts say she's unlikely to pay the $300 million owed to her former label. Just weeks after her $300 million court loss, Cora Phillips has declared bankruptcy. Her assets will now be sold to pay creditors.
just learned that Cora Phillips's application for assisted euthanasia has been approved in Switzerland. What do you make of her choosing to die on the same day the real Kira Vale died? She's clearly trying to send a message, but it's absurd. She shouldn't go through with it. Will we miss her? No. But we'll sure miss roasting her. She'll go to Switzerland, she'll die, and Earth will keep spinning. It's just another day. Cora Phillips, you are here because you have chosen, on your own, to part ways with life. If you drink this, you will die. Once it enters your body, there's no turning back. Do you understand? Legally, I'm not allowed to give this to you directly. I'll place it on the table. The decision to take it is yours alone. You don't have to do it if you don't want to. There is always time to change your mind. Receiving reports that Cora Phillips, the controversial cloned singer, has died this morning in a Swiss clinic after undergoing assisted euthanasia. In the wake of Cora Phillips' death, human cloning has been suspended worldwide as an ethics committee reviews the practice and considers new regulations. We won't release the names of existing clones to protect their right to choose their own paths and live free from public pressure. <laughs> Today, we're proud to introduce Kira 2.0, an AI music generator modeled after our hit artist, Kira Vale. Our AI music generator keeps what made Kira Vale great and leaves out what didn't. We've optimized it to avoid Cora Phillips' mistakes. Visit our website to generate jazz tracks in Kira Vale style with a simple prompt. Each one comes to life through our servers and algorithms. <laughs> 